hi guys welcome back to another video but before we get into the video make sure you subscribe hit the bell notification and the like the video guys we got a couple topics to get into and let's start off with diamond trying to look like you know banner boy guys diamond yesterday he introduced to ha his fans you know has new look and when i'm telling you kuwa it looks very similar to nani nani banner boy jubana boy he is the one who is known to have these dreads i'm like come on they even look the same look at this picture guys he looks like banner boy with kenya west shoes diamond he is going through a lot i feel like diamond he does not know who he who he is he's trying to find out like he's lost like a couple months ago he was trying to look like asake and right now he's trying to look you know like banner boy maybe he thinks looking like banner boy it's gonna give him fans outside of africa white people fans he thinks maybe looking like you know um, like banner boy it's going to help him sell tickets who call london like he's doing like he's making three millions dollar in one show i'm like stop trying too hard looking like banner boy ain't gonna help you go international ain't gonna help you kujaza yani arena ya huko uk no stop trying too hard and be yourself where is the originality here let's move on and talk about saudi soul ju Saudi Soul, there is this American rapper called Tusi. I'm a sample. Nimbo ya Saudi Soul, Kuriko Jana, on his new song, Iko Kwa album, Yake Gods Love Me. And guys, when I'm telling you, Kwa, when I heard it, I was like, you better have cut a big check for them because you cannot use the song without be cutting that big check. And so guys. guys I just hope he did cut a big check for Saudi Soul because this song was, you know, the most successful song from Saudi Soul. So this shows us Kua as Kenya, we do not only make hits, we also make timeless songs. The songs that even alias like celebrities who are even out of Africa to use our song because we are talented. So guys, it looks like Otide Brown, he want some Bridget. So guys, if you don't know, there is this young beautiful woman who is trending and I eat her Bridget Brew. She is the voice. She got the voice. Guys, I knew about her yesterday. I went and checked some of the songs, the covers, the voice is there. Guys when i'm telling you kuwa nikita kalen needs to watch out for this young lady she's beautiful she's talented so it looks like even otide brown he want him some bridget i'm a talk on instagram yeah can i tag bridget akasema please i would love to be on the remix whenever you are ready i am here for it bridget you better work for, with otile brown because this can set you off like this can put you on on the map nakumuka vile jovia kifanya na otile brown was a hit i'm here for it i am here for it guys you better check go check some song of wise who you Mustana, she's very beautiful and talented and guys let's talk about Nadia Mukama because Nadia Mukama and Alo Boy they have back together they are looking amazing back to i can say back together because i would confirm but guys i don't know if they have get back together but i feel like them you know linking up doing all those you know kiki who call instagram with arrow boy i feel like it's because of their careers their careers was in the toilets to be quite honest they both have been you know struggling to get a hit especially arrow boy so i feel like both coming together working together getting back together if for the public to pay attention they have been both 
flapping their career is in the toilet they are trying to save it let's be on it but what caught a lot of people attention if anyone is saying Najam come and post his small clip na clip na kasema this is what a 3.8 million video look looks like guys I was like who is the director we gotta take the director in court because if you have spent the money for this week as video I am definitely looking at you side side i'm like nadia mukama you need to go outside touch some grass because you cannot spend all the money for this cheap ass video the visual world of me were okay mid i was i was like i was not impressed but stop lying so guys let's finish off with sanasha because she was looking amazing yesterday on instagram body giving having fun with friends and i was like sanasha what's up with you guys it Yesterday I saw Infinix Iki Tamburisha brand ambassador Wapia we did so they brought back Kate they brought back this guy and I was like where is Tanasha the last time we did so Infinix na na when my celebrity Tanasha was there with Kate with this guy I was like yo take away Tanasha's donut deal Infinix we gotta have a talk don't tell me you replaced Tanasha with these two young beautiful ladies. I'm like, okay. Because Tanasha Munakumbuka, Mwakurio Pita, she was the one who was promoting Infinix and Samsung and everything. And right now, she does not have a brand deal. I'm like, Tanasha, you need to get back outside working. If people are talking about you, then these companies are going to come after you. So I feel like Tanasha, you better stop, get up better get work release some new music do some drama but guys jump in the comments tell me what do you think about these topics make sure you subscribe hit that bell notification i'm gonna see you in the next video bye, -bye.